Power internet users have a certain kind of secret knowledge. Call it a detour to understanding the ways of the web. This knowledge is often tapped by older parents who don't know how their printers work. But alas, these power users know that sometimes it's faster to download a file than it is to upload that same file. But why? Well, you can blame how Spectrum, our radio wave-based superhighway of information exchange, is shared. Today, Spectrum is shared between upstream and downstream traffic, either in time division duplexing or in frequency division duplexing. In FDD, the upstream occupies a certain portion of the spectrum while the downstream occupies the remaining available spectrum from the provider. In TDD, the streams take turns using the available spectrum. Both FDD and TDD borrow spectrum from download streams to increase upload streams and vice versa. This leads to an inevitable traffic jam of data. When uploads and downloads share the same lanes on the information superhighway, there's bound to be backups, and traffic jams are painful. But digital traffic jams are downright maddening. This is where full duplex doxis comes in. With full duplex doxis, the upstream and downstream traffic use the same spectrum at the same time. Imagine the flow of information literally dividing into two roads, enjoying their own free lanes of space to move at maximum speeds, which means you can upload and download up to 10 gigabits on a conventional network simultaneously. In a full duplex doxis future, that one gig video file will upload at the same speed as your one gig of video downloads, solidifying your internet power user status. No word on if your parents ever figured out that wireless printer, though. <laughs> Welcome to the highway of the future.